Hello everyone, you're in Endurance Laser Lab. In this video, I want to show you how you can replace your older board with GRBL 0.9 version with a new board that supports uh, later versions like GRBL 1.1H, E, or F. So we are using uh, Maker uh, Base MKS uh, DLC version uh, 2.0 so it's pretty good board we really, we really like it we are working with that more than one year and we had no problem so it has three axes and you see the drivers over here uh, wires go to um, stepper motors and we have a laser pin over here okay we use X loader to upload the firmware and uh, then we can uh, upload it. Uh, the latest version we have is on our download center and uh, on our GRBL page on endurance lasers. Okay, we have some mistakes here. Let's let me fix it. Okay, so we are uploading 1.1H uh, firmware. Okay, we have. Uh, the speed uh, 57k or you can and you need to select proper uh, com port and we're uploading it okay so now it's uh, uploaded and actually we had some problems with lower speed so you need to set up uh, one hundred thousand uh, yeah 1152 double zero speed sound rate so everything's ready and let's check what we have uh, in Lightburn. Okay, now we have Lightburn software and we select uh, our machine and connect it via COM port. We really like Lightburn software, it's a pretty good one. And you see that this uh, version of our firmware is GRBL 1.1H. Okay, now we need to open uh, settings uh, machine settings and here you see all GRBL settings that uh, you have you can read them or if you already have uh, saved versions of uh, your uh, of your machine of your frame uh, you can upload them so you can either read them for further uh, you know, let's say applications or upload if you already have them so uh, this uh, description um, these settings are well described on our website. All you need to know about GRBL, where, where we have we describe all parameters for each each setting. But uh, yeah, this is for CNC 3018 machine. Let me show you. This is our machine with 10 watt DPSS uh, laser module. Okay, just let me give you a few uh, notes about important parameters. So laser mode enable uh, S32 allows you to have a dynamic PWM. So it allows you to change power for every single, uh, for every single uh, spot, for every single pixel. So you can do a grayscale. Okay, another important thing for regulating power for the laser should be max spindle speed. So we have it here, 1000, and Pasha will show you another settings where it should be the same. Uh, so mm. this parameter, so it's it's in device settings, it should be also be the same. So it, uh, it will allow you to change power and set up power correctly. Almost done, and we have uh, these parameters for x steps per minute. Uh, oh, sorry, per millimeter. So this is a amount of steps in one millimeter. So it could be. It depends on on your stepper motor that you use, and the type of your machine. And also, you can check ch change acceleration, uh, max travel speed. So actually. You can change anything, but uh, in our, on our website we have a disc uh, detailed description for those parameters. So now you know how to change firmware and what key parameters you need to set up if you want to replace your current board uh, with a new uh, with a new GRBL compatible board. So that 
could be quite useful if you have uh, the, your board that is not working, especially that's very practical for those who have uh, a CAN firmware and it doesn't work because a CAN is, is not very good software or laser X, uh, CNCC laser X. So just replace a board, upload a GRBL uh, uh, firmware, set up proper parameters and your, your machine will be like brand new, <laughs> very, very user friendly. So I do hope that you like this video. Please uh, subscribe on our channel, share these videos with your friends and if people have any problems with firmware, and just share this video. And if you have any questions about settings, parameters, you're welcome to email me gf at endurancerobots.com, my email and my phone is plus seven nine one six two two five four three two. I'll be happy to give you some inputs. And don't forget to visit our website endurancelasers.com and our online store endurance-lasers.com to learn more about our diode and DPSS laser models. Have a great and wonderful experience with endurance. Bye-bye.